hi everyone welcome back to a new video so in this video we are going to understand our design so that based on this design we can able to build a web application so in uh yeah, i have made one sample design like a blueprint or a just a random architecture diagram or whatever whatever you call which you like okay so by taking a reference of the design we are going to make a web application in upcoming videos okay so actually this is just a normal e-commerce website or e-commerce web application so we'll be making the e-commerce web application only through angular we are going to design everything using components creating components uh, like using uh, uh, also implementing routers everything we'll be making an entire angular application okay just like uh, by or by the reference of this design so in this video we'll understand what we are going to do in upcoming videos all right so as you can see in normally in all uh, all the uh, e-commerce website there will be a login page for a user to login correct so we'll be designing uh, this kind of login page using angular all right and uh, it's not that how you how you normally do in normal html it's not like that so we'll be creating a components so component based application will be doing in our coding part all right so this is how we are going to make a login page okay so this is how we are going to make a home page so when a user logs in with the proper username and credentials so that user need to or get access to a home page like this okay so we'll add one sample logo in, in our uh, development part and we're going to make this kind of header and this kind of uh, foot over here and also what is this ads so i'll just show you this sample thing over here so let's say i'll open uh, amazon amazon so that we have uh, uh, that a design in amazon okay so yeah here we have amazon as you can see here there are some ads are going on like under 1999 see when i click on this button a slide keep on changing or images keep on changing same thing which we'll be doing in our application as well okay so we'll understand that so main thing here not here i'm not concentrating about more on uh, css or design i'm just concentrating how we can able to use your which you know html and css in angular application okay we'll be using for the design we'll be using bootstrap itself so no need to worry about that but main thing what i want you guys to understand is how we can able to use or how we can able to build a web application using angular okay so this is a card and normally we call it i call this as a card so if i show you what my card is like this see like this so for this we call it as a card right okay so this is a card like a product image will be the product name and product description and when you click on buy it has to uh, go to card something like that all right so a footer it will be there in every website correct yes so this is our login page this is our home page for our application so next see also whenever we click on this category this has to go to category page and when whenever we click on products this has to go to products page and normally i'm telling pages 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 it's not pages in another application will be redirect to a different component so for category we'll be create, creating a different component and for, for products we'll be creating a different uh, component all right so when i click on categories it should go to another component like this okay like this so home category and here we need to display all the different categories of uh, products let's say here we have a tv category mobile category earphones category and a laptop category so when we click on the category based on the category we need to get the products all right and our pro when we click a products page it has to redirect to product page like this so header footer and a products see if you observe header and this menu bar and footer is common for all the pages right right so it's gone for all the pages expect login page correct so we'll be making this without making the code duplication means we'll be making the separate separate component so that we <coughs> we want to duplicate the code all right so we'll understand how we key, how we can able to make this kind of web application in our upcoming videos so and also video will come very fast and no need to worry i'll teach you very clearly you won't able to forget it 
all right and when you are building this application if you face any issue or any error and also i'll pin my um, email id uh, to this comments as well and also in upcoming videos as well so you can drop me a mail and send me a screenshot of the error which you're getting i'll reply as soon as possible all right main thing my objective is i want you guys to learn learning is main motto in this channel so learning my tea all right so thank you for watching this video guys and uh, we'll meet in our next video and Shindel, take care goodbye bye bye